I have a dream that there will be peace in the world and not war. I have a dream that one day the whole world will have clean water. I have a dream that we can remove poverty globally. It was a day of reflection. These are very difficult and challenging times. And a call to action. You have to figure out if there's evil in the world and do something about it. Through tributes. How we don't have to condemn a whole class of people based on the actions of some, do you see it? How all the names are different. How all the faces are different. Performances. And advocacy. Remembering an iconic leader who fought for equality and justice for all who used his thunderous voice to deliver some of the most influential speeches in American history. I have a dream that my four little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin but by the content of their character. I have a dream today. Attendees, inspired by King Jr.'s words, recited their own dreams. I have a dream that Peace and justice will prevail throughout the whole world. We all live in peace and harmony. I have a dream that one day we will all be free from oppressive systems that hold us down and hold us back from fulfilling our full human capacity and potential. It was the 30th consecutive year of the All People's Celebration. Buenos dias! But organizer Andrea Guerrero with Alliance San Diego says this year's tone was different after a troubling year when neo-Nazis marched through the streets of Charlottesville and the President of the United States accused of racism. This is a moment of truth for us who have lived here in this country through a year of, of adversity, through a year of hate, through a year of challenge. Guerrero is hoping the event inspires people to stand together with renewed momentum. Fight fiercely, love fiercely. She and her team plan to use their momentum to fight for immigration rights for dreamers this week in Washington, ahead of a DACA government funding deadline on January 19th. And we will be meeting with legislators and we will be participating in advocacy events, activist events. And following in the footsteps of Martin Luther King Jr., who dedicated his life to advocacy and urging love and compassion for all humanity. I have a dream that one day we can all live in peace and harmony. Susan Murphy, KPBS News.